Alright, we're picking up here. Sorry there's gonna be a bit of a sound lag. That's okay. At least you kinda know what they're saying. Everyone wants the same thing. To be just a little happier than they are now. Nothing big. Just food, shelter, and time to laugh and cry with the people they love. That's enough to make them happy. Happy? What does that even mean? Now you can kind of see what the whole... whole progress of finding happiness is. And it's kind of understandable to some extent. But then again... Yuri is still one of those clean-cut Japanese RPG characters who has some kind of emotional baggage. And sucky past and whatever. Now, I want to move on to yet another cutscene by visiting jo Bishop Jovis. Let's see, room isn't here. Now this this setup is kind of like many Japanese RPGs. It's kind Bishop of Jovis. the whole tragic instance, but I am still, if you keep watching it, you, you'll right. yes. understand what we met will happen. So, like you told us to, we met your friend too. Was he doing well? Yeah, he's having a great time. <laughs> is that right? You see. Nothing to worry about. Just rest and get your strength back. No. This is the end for me. You mustn't say that. Yeah, come on. What would the people in this valley do here without you? That is for my followers to say, children. I have taught them everything that I can. I think I have say that. had enough Listen. spoilers. Just angel, Astaroth. For sensitive hearts, Astaroth? don't watch. Enough said. Like Asmodeus and Amon, he is another god of darkness. Someone has made a soul pact with him. And guess who that person is? I don't know who this person is, but when you meet them, beware. I can handle it. I'll drop him just like a bad habit. <laughs> Bishop Jovis. Please. Forgive me. I swear to God, I didn't mean it. I never meant to sacrifice the people of this valley to save Russia. I hate it. When people let others die just to get what they want. Yeah, this is gonna come back Listen and bite you in the me. butt later on. If with my death the people lose all hope, then my life has been in vain. But if I had someone to succeed me, I know that the valley would survive. <sighs> then for the first time, it could be said that I live on among my people. Don't you think so? Jovis. Yes. My son. He who has willpower has the power to change the whole world. Whether that change be for good or for evil depends on the heart of that person. We're mortal. We live in fear and... and doubt. There's no shame in admitting that. When 
Albert died, he passed the world on to you, didn't he? Now it's in your hands. Go to Russia. Only you have the power to save the young princess. I wonder if Mario got a lecture on this. I swear it. I swear I'll beat Rasputin. When he's dead, I'll come back. Don't die on me. I'll try. Yuri! takes upon himself the burden my friend and I bore together. Now I have finally fulfilled my promise. Now I can face my friend. Bishop? Please give him my Things are getting pretty tragic, and now for another upside, more cutscenes! That day, Petrograd held a glorious celebration. Was kind of a victory this? parade for the Tsar returning from his tour of the Eastern Front. the same Front. voice actor that was the. Although much love for him was lost on that bloody Sunday of a decade ago. On this day, the people raised their voices in celebration of their Tsar. But like a candle burning more brightly the moment before it is snuffed out, it was glory tinged with tragedy. And it's not over yet. We still have like a few more minutes. We have to see this part, which doesn't do. How on it earth am I says the status quo the that we have to change. Without even knowing if Anastasia is all right. What are you saying? But this is an important night for you. No, for all of Russia. Nothing is more important to me than the safety of my children. You must relax. Grigori is pressuring Edgar for more information about his co-conspirators. Aren't you even worried? Your beautiful daughter was kidnapped. Besides, Edgar treated Anastasia as his very own granddaughter. I can't believe he would be involved. But I saw it with my very own eyes. Thank Those you, stupidity. Dr. Here were controlling Anastasia. She almost killed Alexei with a knife. Yes, you've told me that many times. <laughs> and you never get bored of saying that. When this banquet is over, I'm going to question Edgar myself. There's no need, Your Majesty. No. Oh. Rasputin, have you found anything? Yes. Tell me, Grigor. He was very tight-lipped, but I used hypnotism to learn of his companions. They're an organization intent on taking the life of the Tsar and his family. What? Mm, ditto. Is this true? Yes. Among them is a German noblewoman. She has strong military connections, so this may be part oh, yeah, of an attempted coup. The Kaiser My cousin uh, Wilhelm Germany, since ev Majesty. everyone's practically related to him. Surely it is our enemy this time to shake the confidence of the Tsar. But how? Just attend the ball as if nothing is amiss. I'm gonna pause we must here. Must show the rest of the world the greatness and composure of Russia.